If you want to get into cybersecurity, you might be wondering, which certificate should you get? There are so many different cybersecurity certificates out there that are being offered by various vendors. But here's the truth. Hi, my name is Steven, and I've been in cybersecurity for over half a decade within the security operations domain. And this question comes up quite often. There is a misconception for those trying to get into this industry thinking that a certificate is all you need to land a job, and that is simply not true. So what certificate should you get? Well, the answer is really, it depends on what domain interests you the most. If you're looking to pursue a certificate, you want to ask yourself these two questions. Number one, what does it cover? Understanding the material of said certificate is important. You don't want to chase after certificates for the sake of obtaining them. For example, just because Bobby has a Linux fundamental certification, doesn't mean that you should take it just to show that you have the skill and certificate, unless the position that you're going after requires it. If not, I would highly recommend you put your time and money into something else, which brings me to the second question. Number two, does this align with your interest? You see, cybersecurity is extremely wide and there are multiple domains within this industry. Ideally, you would already know which domain interests you the most, and by knowing that, you'll have a better handle on whether the certificate would align with your interest or not. For example, if you're interested in, let's say, security operations, and you start to hear people talk about how CISA is such a great certificate to have, this is where you can ask, what does CISA cover? Oh, it covers auditing processes and implementation. Now, does that align with your interest? Well, no, it doesn't. This is more tailored towards an auditor, GRC, Governance, Risk, and Compliance. Whereas if you come across certified cyber defenders, this covers topics about security operations, making this certificate more aligned with your interest. There are so many different cybersecurity certificates out there that are being offered by various vendors. But here's the truth. At the end of the day, certifications alone is not going to get you the job unless you know someone. So what I would recommend you do is that if you're not sure what you're interested in yet, but know that cybersecurity is your calling, Go out and obtain a well-known industry certificate, such as the CompTIA Security Plus, and that is it. Hopefully, by that time, you'll have a better understanding of what domain that you want to get into, as you'll need to start to work on your hands-on skills relating to that domain. Network with others, do projects, and put yourself in scenarios that make you uncomfortable. Don't fall into the trap in trying to obtain and collect as many certifications as you possibly can, especially if you're short on money. Now, don't get me wrong, I would recommend you learn the material related to the other certifications via free resources, but the only certificate that I would recommend you try and obtain would be the CompTIA Security Plus. That way, you can have something that you can put onto your resume and is fairly safe. In other words, many job postings have this as a nice to have or mandatory. To summarize, what cybersecurity certification should you get? It really depends on your domain of interest, but I would highly recommend getting at least a CompTIA Security Plus, and then focus more on practical experiences related to your domain of interest. Afterwards, if you do come across certificates that you're questioning, always ask yourself these two questions. What does this certificate cover and does it align with your interest? Last but not least, don't go collecting certificates for the sake of collecting them. That is it for the video and I hope that you found that informative. If you did, let me know by hitting that like button and subscribe if you want to. Remember to stay curious and do things differently.